an eclipse takes place when one heavenly body such as a moon or planet moves into the shadow of another heavenly body. A lunar eclipse happens when Earth gets in the way of the sun's light hitting the moon. But, in 2021, we are going to observe two lunar eclipses. Stay tuned with us to know more about this lunar eclipse, and if you like our video, then don't forget to hit that like and subscribe to Gateway to Knowledge to know more about such astronomical events. Before starting this journey, let me tell you that there are three types of lunar eclipse which include total lunar eclipse, partial lunar eclipse and penumbral lunar eclipse. If we look back, then previously we had a total eclipse of the moon on January 21, 2019. But now on May 26, 2021, the full moon will sweep through the Earth's shadow to stage a short-lived total eclipse of the moon. Although in total it will last for just 13 to 15 minutes, this lunar eclipse will first be followed by a partial lunar eclipse, and then we will observe a total lunar eclipse. So, the moon will take a little over three hours to cross the Earth's dark shadow. But to your surprise, there is something interesting in this total lunar eclipse. This full moon in May counts as the closest and the biggest full moon of the year, coming about 100 miles closer to Earth. That's why some people may call it a supermoon. The term supermoon was coined by astrologer Richard Knoll in 1979 and refers to either a new or full moon that occurs when the moon is within 90% of perigee. A supermoon appears about 7% bigger than the moon typically looks at its average distance of 239,000 miles from Earth. When the moon appears near the horizon, an optical illusion can cause it to look much bigger. In comparison to trees, buildings, and mountains, the moon looks far bigger than it does when set higher up against the vastness of space. In addition, this full moon is set to coincide with a total lunar eclipse. Now you may be waiting to see when and where this lunar eclipse can be seen. Well, this total lunar eclipse is visible in western North America, southern and far western South America, the Pacific Ocean New Zealand, Australia and Southeast Asia. From the Americas, this eclipse takes place in the early morning hours before sunrise on May 26, whereas from the world's eastern hemisphere including New Zealand, Australia and Southeast Asia, the eclipse occurs in the evening hours after sunset on May 26. So, keep observing the sky to see this lunar eclipse, because it will last for quite a short time.